Hello, Brenton with All of Octane here, and in this video, I'm going to open up five of the brand new Matchbox Convoys that I was able to find on the pegs. I was able to find these over the holiday break, and I was able to find five out of six. So the top two go to the same series, the bottom three go to the other series. You can tell by the back which series they are a part of. So you have the Skyjacker and the Lone Star, you've got the Tesla and Load Lifter, and you've got the Western Star and the Nissan Junior. For some reason, the Tesla with the pipes was not at the Meyer store that I went to. I was uh, on vacation up near my I was at my parents' house and they have Meyer up there. So I was able to find these out of Meyer on the pegs. And here we've got a Western, uh, well, we've got the Lone Star with the cab and we have the Skyjacker Bronco. So this is the second kind of livery that we've seen of Skyjacker Broncos. Wow, I'm sorry, that's very loud. Let's see, there we go. So here is the Lone Star with the Skyjacker trailer, and I believe, oh, I think these used to open. Well, that's a bummer. Don't open. Eh, it's kind of a disappointment. I can't remember if the first ones did, and I dropped it, so maybe it'll open now. <laughs> no, it, it did not. There we go. So there is the uh, Skyjacker suspension, and then we have the really cool Bronco that goes with it right there. Kind of a muted, Reddish orange, not really sure what kind of color it is. Nice bronze wheels, that's kind of cool. But a Bronco is always nice, and here we have one. All right, next up is the, again, second in the series, or well, I guess third, I don't have load lifter in the Tesla with the semi-pipes, although I do already have a load lifter and a Tesla, just not that one. Um, so we have the Sriracha, Nissan Junior with the Western Star 49X day cap and tanker. All right, Sriracha. I'm not a big Sriracha fan. I, I That is one sauce that I struggle to, that and cocktail sauce. I, honestly, to me, cocktail sauce and Sriracha are very hard to get behind. I, I For some reason, that is just not my palate. Don't really know why, but it is. Uh, there's no interior to this cab. The windows are all blacked out, or I guess grayed out. We've got the Sriracha since 1980, and the Nissan Junior. Nice bright green. I believe, have we seen this before? I believe we've seen this before. So they're just kind of reusing cars like the Mustang, like the Tesla. They're basically just putting stuff for more money grabs, but uh, they grabbed it because <laughs> I gave them the money. All right, here we've got the Tesla Model S and the semi-trailer. I'm not really sure if this is going for big money or not. I was surprised I found it, but I'm going to open it because why not? I haven't even opened the Tesla Matchbox yet, just the singles. I found one, but I haven't been able to find it on camera for you guys because I just have not uh, found any other cars to go with it. Satin red. It's a good-looking car. I don't know when it'll ever hit the market. I know semis are starting to hit the market, but again, don't know how relevant or how plentiful they'll be. This one doesn't open either. It would be really nice for it to open and then kind of hold the car, but I guess it would have to be a little bit wider than that. So, but the Tesla Model S and this kind of bronze wheels with the satin red, it's good stuff. Zero emissions. That's pretty cool. This is probably one of the highlights, or at least most people will probably find this to be a highlight. This one actually is more exciting to me because this one is a five pack, the Mustang in this, the 68 California CS, California Special, is part of a five pack, as I struggle to open that. It's part of a five pack that I haven't bought yet but now I don't have to. This looks a lot kind of like uh, Richard Rawlings Mustang. Look at that, nice and green. Really cool stuff. That's yeah, a good looking Mustang. And then it has the kind of car hauler where you can put the cars up, 
and chive them up, balance them out, and then I think this snaps into place. I believe so. Yeah, it snaps into place so you can carry the cars without having to worry about them falling, and then you can snap it back down, and it will go back down. And carried by one of the MBX L200s. Or I guess, does this have a license model? 68 Ford Mustang GT, Cal yep, CS, California Special, MBX cab over. Oh, so, not a license model. Really cool truck though, nonetheless, auto transport. And man, that is really cool. Last up is the MBX cab over. So the exact same truck basically, in the exact same paint scheme, just about. Look at that, super close. With a power lift, which is also pretty cool. So it's nice to have this one. It's nice to have like some sort of vehicle to kind of pretend that you're doing loading dock. And I think this one goes up and down, if I'm not mistaken. Does it or does it not? I guess it does not. Oh wait, no, there it goes. Yep, that's cool. So you can put in the load, even though it doesn't open, pull out the load, take it down. This thing is pretty nifty. There's power lift. And then last up is the cab over, or the, yeah, cab over with a box. United States Convoys, pretty cool. So there you have it. There are the brand new Matchbox Convoys that I was able to find on the pegs. Have you been able to find them? If so, which ones are your favorites? Let me know in the comments below. And until the next one, have a good one.